welcome, welcome, welcome. We are back with another edition of Shondo on the Go, and we're here at Citrix Summit 2019, where I've made my way over to the NetScout booth, and I am talking to my good friend, Babak Roshanayi. Good to see you again, Sean. Very good to see you too, my friend. Welcome. Hey, Babak, for those of our viewers who don't know NetScout right now, how would you describe NetScout? What is it? Of course, NetScout is synonymous with network monitoring. You know, some people call it network traffic monitoring or wire data or data in motion. We're the oldest company in this business. The company has been around for about 30 years. We're in 80% of Fortune 500, all top federal and state agencies. We're in top 100 service providers around the world. You might not realize, but the service providers are using our gear to track, uh, for example, the user experience across LTE, tie it to their TCP portion and provide full visibility to what okay. the users are doing. So we see everything that goes on and that data gets mined and pushed to our management platform and leveraged via a series of apps that are used for performance, operations, and security management. Okay, so NetScout is ensuring a good user experience because most times, you know, a user may have a slow log on or a slow app launch and blame it on something, but NetScout can get to the root cause of that? There's really no better use case for our technology than, uh, let's say, Citrix the user experience over ICA. Yeah. I say that because there's lots of research that's shown that roughly about 150 milliseconds latency, brain perceives delay. People stop working and using the application. A lot of the remote desktop use cases are about deploying solutions across a continental or an intercontinental WAN. Okay. They deal with mobile users and remote users that deal with last mile technologies, all of these have lots of latency. What I'm saying is that when you deploy a Citrix uh, solution, you have to ensure that everything is running really, really well. We see what's happening in the back end, we see what happens with the user end device, we see the traffic as it travels uh, across the network, and of course we have licensed ICA decodes and we peer into ICA's performance right. and we pull it all together. So is NetScout cloud only? Is it on-prem? Is it hybrid? Where does it live? NetScout solution uh, entails instrumentation and management. So the instrumentation taps the wire and listens to the traffic and generates lots of metadata that gets sent to the manager. So let me talk about the instrumentation modality. It could be a physical network. It could be private uh, cloud, OpenStack, KVM, we can attach to the hypervisor and efficiently grab uh, the network traffic, not from the soft switch, but from the hypervisor's memory so we don't impact performance. And uh, thirdly, in public cloud, we have created uh, a very efficient small footprint agent that can attach to any Unix okay. or Windows workload. Yeah. And so we're universally deployable in virtually any environment you have. And given that we live in a hybrid multi-cloud world and most, most large enterprises have uh, assets in any of these environments, we can pull a, a total global picture of your environment together for you in, in terms of application uh, discovery maps and uh, performance dashboard and show you everything in one view. Okay, and lastly, Babak, NetScout is part of Citrix Ready. So what are the benefits of Citrix Ready to NetScout? So we've been a Citrix Ready uh, partner for five or six years and it tells you that Citrix certifies your solution. But Citrix Ready has been much more than that for us. They've been a tremendous partner in both marketing activities and just to give them a plug back, I could not be happier with a better partner than Citrix Ready at Citrix. All right, nice. Shameless plug for our sponsor, Citrix Ready. All right, everybody, that does it for this episode of Shondo on the Go. Until next time, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.